In this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix duplicate albums on iTunes or music. Apple Music, however you want to call it. As you can see, sometimes you have a particular album and then it shows a duplicate. Some people do a quick fix by clicking on get info and then marking this album as a compilation of songs that kind of like joins them both together, but that doesn't work. Eventually it comes back. So I have the actual solution for this. So as you can see, one song is right here and the rest of the songs are on this other one. So the problem with this is that the album probably doesn't have a album artist sort information in the metadata. So we can just go ahead and, and fix that and that will tell iTunes to join them together. So I have the album right here. These are all the songs. So there are two ways of fixing this. We have the automatic way and then I have a manual way. I only resort to the manual once the other one doesn't work. So the automatic way it's using Music Brains, which is a tagger like it finds the metadata for the album. I'll try to find the website for you to download Music Brains. It's pretty cool. I totally recommend it. So once you have all the songs, just go to Music Brains and then just drag and drop them in this screen right here. So once you drag and drop all the songs into Music Brains, it will show here on the left where you can just select all of them and then right click and then click scan. It will most likely find the album if it's like a popular release from a popular artist. It will find the album in Music Brains and it will fill up all the metadata for the album. Here we go. So this is the whole album. Going to open it up and it's going to match all the songs that I have put in there with their particular metadata. So I'm going to just select the album, which is the whole thing. And I'm going to look for album artist sort order. So the ones that are green means that it didn't have it before, but Music Brain had added it. So as you can see, album artist sort order was missing. It was completely empty, but Music Brains has added that into this whole album. So because I don't like the the, the reverted thing. I'm just going to copy the name of the artist and I'm going to paste it again. So now this will add the name of the artist into the whole album and that will fix the duplicate problem. So I'm just going to right click on the album and then click on save. And now that all of this information has been saved, I'm going to go back into iTunes. I'm going to remove it, delete from library. I can keep the files and then again, delete from library delete songs and keep the files. And now that I have completely removed them from iTunes, I'm going to add it again. Just click open, open all files. And there we have it. As you can see now, it only shows one album and all of the songs are completely in there with all the metadata filled up. So that will fix the double album cover. Um, sorry, I promise you to show you the manual way. If Music Brains doesn't work, like if you cannot find the artist on Music Brains, you can use something like Yate, for example, or any other like MP3 tag, whatever the name of those are. Um, you can also drag and drop all the songs into the, the Yate or whatever program, and then just select them all. And then on info, or probably sorting actually, on sorting, just make sure that you fill up the information, sort album artist, then you make sure that you add the name of the artist if it's missing, and here as well. So just make sure that you fill up all the information for the sorting, and that will fix the double album problem. I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.